Let's get on with the show, y'all. Hey, 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 it's Drew, it's Drew, it's Drew. He's coming back with that hot resub. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Coming in hot, coming in hot. Here's Drew with the fat resub. Coming in just in time for the end. Yeah, you are just in time. Assuming that this is just right, we're in here and we're fighting Smithy right here, which it might be. But welcome in, Drew. There he is. There he fucking is, y'all. Hey! There's the last star piece! Yeah, thanks for the 33 month reset, sir, and welcome in. Huh? Already finished your tour of the factory, huh? Alright then. How about a little demonstration? Yo, Smithy! <laughs> I like that he said, Yo, Smithy. Stop making those things and hand over the star piece now. Huh? <laughs> so you're Mario. Looks like we're gonna have a little dispute over the star. Just hand it over and get out of my castle, bro. My, my, we're a little touchy today, aren't we? You know, I'm actually growing rather fond of this place. Please don't make us go through anymore. Just give us the star now. Huh, better yet. Why don't you give me your stars? Why, then I can easily conquer this world. Then we can get rid of all wishes and create a world filled with weapons. Mario's like, let's fuck him up. Over here, now, I'll crush you all. All right, y'all, it's Smithy time. That Smithy music, though. I remember it was different. I also remember this is not one form and we're done multiple forms you support the good shit drew well i appreciate you supporting good shit also hey mara what's up what's up girl what's up sorry i'm just taking in the music right now if you're, if you're wondering why i haven't clicked anything yet it goes pretty hard all right let's get into it y'all it's time to fuck some shit up okay so I got stuff. I don't know if I should use it till we're in another form though. Like I got this red essence, I got this energizer. I might save it till we're in another form though. <laughs> I'm really in the mood for a pizza. A pizza that ass. Damn it, Mara. Damn it. Soon. Ah, <sighs> this music does go pretty hard though. It's good stuff. All right, should we? I'm gonna hit him with a regular attack and just see how much it does. 153. Okay. Sledge. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, some damage. Okay. I see you. I see you, boy. I'm gonna attack him normal just to see how much damage I do, and then I'll try out some some magic stuff. Um, let's just do group hug for now. Very much digging the song. Okay, oh, I meant to do a magic attack. See how much it would do. All right, let me hit him with the uh, super jump. Yeah, let's try that. Damn it. 75. Boo. Brings out a he brings out a homie, huh? Hit him with a psych bomb, then fuck it. <laughs> this is the last stream till next week. Yes, indeed it is. Oh, you can attack that thing over there too to the to the gold the gold thing on the left, which I didn't realize. Well, shit. In that case, Bowser crash. That is a dangerous move, dog. Dying dangerous indeed. Ultra flame. Wait, does ultra flame not hit all? Super flame? No. Um, I know ultra jump hits all, but I don't. I'm just gonna have a uh, Mario fucking clock him. It's more damage that way, I think. 
How will we fill the void for a week? You can go over to twitch.tv slash roommate, my boy. Well, unless you're there, not, if you're a late night. Otherwise, you can go to twitch.tv slash somebody else. <laughs> Shy guy, out of here. Damn, Bowser got fucking owned. Owned to a crisp. I'm gonna save my like my all out mode when we see the next form. I don't remember how many forms this dude has, but I do remember multiple forms. Like, I'm not expecting to have to use any Caro Caro Colas at all. But I might use that Red Essence, and I might use that, uh, the other thing. The Energizer. Damn it, Bozer, why are you missing? And Mario's dead. Damn it. Oh well. Damn, fucking Mario, or Bowser's gonna die again too. It's a lot of pressure, Drew. You already feel fill the void of when I'm done streaming. You stream after me, so f Drew, you don't you don't technically fill the void when I'm gone. You you stream at the like opposite time slot of me on week on every day, so it works out perfectly for you. If anything, maybe Allegory will stream for a week. He already started. Maybe he'll keep going all week. You guys can have him fill the void. <laughs> Smithy Battle has two phases, although the second phase has two, two. The second phase goes through multiple forms. Okay, that's what I'm remembering. Because I remember he changes form, and then he has a bunch of different heads he can have. I remember that. Okay, okay. Thank you for reminding me. Backseating is allowed, after all. I, I'm willing to take hints and reminders and tips and stuff on this playthrough. All right, so he's going to bring out a little second homie. Start using some AoEs here. After I wake up Bozer, of course. Do I still have any items to use? This, is, this would be the time to use them. I don't know if I have any more, though. I think I used them up. Like attack items, magic items. I don't have any more. Okay. That's fine. Um, well, in that case, hit him with the Bowser Crush! You're going to get Allegory again with that hot sauce later, Drew? I was actually going to hit him with it, but Bougie beat me to it. I was waiting for people to show up to the stream, because I was at his stream right when he started. So I was waiting for people to show up to hit him with it, but then Bougie hit him right away, and I was like, oh, I don't even have to do it. You know what? For the sake of just using one of these, I'm going to use one of these Caracara Cara Colas now. Otherwise, I just won't use them. And I got a freebie. Wow, that's fair. Jesus. Like, I needed that. You remember how much you were loving this game on your first playthrough, KY? It is a pretty good game. I'm, what I like about it is, like, it's a fun turn-based RPG with the action fans. And it's also really short. So it's like, it doesn't... It doesn't say fuck you to your time, you know? And not that I don't like RPGs that are long. Some of my favorite ones are really long. But, like, this game could easily overstay its welcome by being longer. So I'm glad it's not, is what I'm trying to say. And I feel like the Paper Mario games did a similar thing with being a little bit longer, of course, but also not overstaying and being, like, ridiculously long. Let's group hug it out. You haven't played this game in 15 years, Drew? Well, time to add it to your catalog of Let's Play stream games. Just to say you did it. <sighs> For SNES standards, I would say it's like this is about expected. I mean, yes and no, KY. There are some long SNES RPGs that are not this one, to be fair. Here we go. No! Ready for form two? 
Calm down, Smithy. Your head looks like a geyser. Don't get so worked up. Think of your blood pressure. We just built this yesterday. And the foundation's very weak. So stop shaking the floor. How utterly annoying! Huh? What the? How in the heck? What in the hecky? Alright, get ready for final battle. Here we go, y'all. We're in hell. Are you ready? No! Oh, I'm burning, seething. Never have I been so wrong. It is time. I will show you my real form. I will show you my true power. I will teach you respect. And I will have my revenge. Shall. No. You said too many words. That, throat, that voice hurts my throat. <laughs> oh, this doofy ass face. I remember this. I was thinking the one where he had like a big lockbox on his head. But I remember this one now. Come on, you pretty ants. All right, guys. Here we go. You remember how you would resort to using colas to heal yourself during the final battle and you would sometimes get freebies? Yeah. Having those colas is OP as shit. All right, he already went to tank head, cool. Um, you know what I'm gonna do? Well, you know, on Peach's turn, I'll do it if I have to. I was gonna say, I'm gonna bust out that Energizer, and I might use it on Mario, because his potential for more damage is higher, even if he won't necessarily always hit more harder than Bowser. And maybe I'll get a freebie, that'd be sick. Nope, no freebie. And Mario's less likely to die than Bowser, I think, as well, so that's another reason. Bowser seems to die easier. Yeah, those freebies on Rock Candy are pretty nice. I got a few of those earlier. Get rid of this. Whatever status effect that is, get rid of it. Anyway, Breath of Fire is definitely a game that's telling you to fuck off with your time. Fuck the second half, yeah. I, I don't remember how ridiculous Breath of Fire 1 could be, but watching Drew play it again reminding me. And making me definitely not look forward to replaying the game ever as a Let's Play or just at all. But it still might happen someday. I don't know. It's not something I'm dead set on doing. I have plenty of other SNES RPGs to play that I haven't played. The tank head has one hit kills? Oh, okay. Well, he didn't get me there, so I'm okay. You're never going to play the first two Breath of Fires either, Luminous? I mean, I've played them. That's the thing. But I don't know if I'll let's play them. I played them on the GBA emulator a long, long, long time ago. Oh, you said again. Yeah. Fair enough. head defensively so I should be going all in okay but well, I won't waste time healing with anybody but peach I know Bowser can't handle some of this magic his de his magic defense is just not good enough without without any armor it's pretty rough all right the magic head is back fuck him up I don't think there's anything I could do to get any stronger hits in. Unless I try to jump on his bitch ass. Don't call it a comeback. I bring in turtles back for years. This dude has some nasty spells even with armor. Oh, I remember. I remember this being a tough fight. In fact, I might have lost on my first attempt fighting this guy originally. I might have. I don't even remember. It's It's been so fucking long. 
I don't remember how things really went. There's the lockbox head I remembered. I guess that's a coffin head. Was there not one that looked like a lockbox? This one's got the highest defense. You think you can attack his body, but that always felt like a waste of time. You can attack his body, I didn't realize, but I'm not gonna bother with that. I don't know, did I block that? What happened? I don't even know what just happened. Counting his normal head, Smithy has four other heads. The tank, the wizard, the safe, and the treasure box. The treasure box is what I was talking about. I forgot about this coffin head, though. Um, I have five FP left. Maybe I'll use this opportunity to use a maple syrup. Just don't have to worry about FP later when it matters. Oh, don't heal, bro. Uh, 120 is not too bad, I suppose. You always thought like that face looked like Courage the Cowardly Dog. I guess it kind of does look like Courage hiding behind the window, staring out. That's kind of funny, actually. <laughs> There's the treasure box head. I guess this battle can't end until you see all the fucking phases. Psychedelic, don't fucking have a seizure, please. This is, where, this is where all the status effects become a thing. Courage the Cowardly Dog hitting you with that real spin nostalgia for show. Holy shit, you just had a seizure, Drew. Please don't have a seizure. Please don't. That'd be bad, okay? You know what I'm gonna do? Screw using magic. I got max mushrooms. Use them. Full heal, bitch. And I got a freebie. Let's go. And that's why you get it, because he could kill you in one shot without full health. Jesus, that damage is ridiculous. Uh, yeah, Mario. Missed me. Now you gotta kiss me. Ha ha. Yeah, shoot Peach more. That I don't care so much about. The tank is definitely offensive, indeed. Bye-bye, Bowser. Nope. Shook him again. Locked it, kind of, sort of. God, this final battle music, so it's so good, though. All this final battle music, so good. How much longer are you gonna fucking fuck with me, Schmitty? How much longer are you gonna linger, you lingerer? You nam jor linger cure?
fucking perfect block that shit, bitch. Oh boy, seizure warning! I have to so that my homies don't have the status effects. Even if I don't need the heal heal. What do you got? Lockbox head again? Yep. Or coffin head again. Safe head. Well, I don't even know. I don't even know what to call it. Uh... Oh, did I not use the energizer? Oh, I used the red essence. I didn't use the energizer. I fucked up. I didn't realize I used the energy the red ener essence. Well, just use the energizer. Attack up, let's go. And I got a freebie, let's fucking go. Man, I could have had two energizers this whole time. The whole time. The whole time, dog. Dude, bring the wizard head back out so I can fuck you up, homie. Uh-oh. Scarecrow time! Square had some great SNES games. For show, sure, man. For show. Sure. Also, Drew over here leaning on his keyboard. Oh, Shredder gets rid of status of status buffs? Oh, is that what that does? Also, he brought the wizard back out. It's time. First time you beat this as a kid, Drew, you used Peach and Malo. Interesting choices. That would have been an all-magic team. But yeah, not having Peach seems really, really difficult at this point. So I can't imagine not having her. Fucking dude is Don Jarus. Ooh, that four hundo. I think it's time for another Kara Caracola. Whoa! I might have got it, y'all. My body and my head are burning. It's not possible. I don't believe it. I'm finished and off. Whoop! Nope! Yeah, this game was pretty much over the moment I put that shit on Peach. You are correct. So anyway. Come on, Mario. Send the last one way up high. Thank you, everybody, for the GGs. Too easy. His final form had 8,000 HP. Good lord. You could have told me that. I already said... This is backseating allowed. Anything is allowed to be told on a replay, man. I'm okay with it. But thank you. 8,000. That is a lot of fucking HP. Goddamn. Alright. We did it. I mean, if you did a no peach run, if you were higher level, it would be a little bit easier. I was only level 21, so keep that in mind. Alright. Alright. Thank you, everyone. The Star Road is back to normal, and... At first you thought all the heads had their own HP bar, and then two... And had to be and had to beat them all separately. I mean, even if they did, you still have to beat them all the same way. It wouldn't have changed anything really. Oh, that's fine, next gamer. If you didn't know until you just checked, that's fine. I was just pointing out that it would have been fine to tell me earlier if you had wanted to. That's all. 
Anyway, Rip Gino, at least his doll form. He's back in the star road where he belongs, or he's about to be anyways. Since he goes up to the star road, it's kind of surprising that even though it's not a direct sequel to this game, I know, but in a way, Paper Mario really is like a sequel to this like style. It's not really that different other than graphically. It's the same kind of game. Um, obviously, it's not the continuation of the story, though. They could totally have had Geno references as one of the star kids or something in Star in, in, in any of the Paper Mario games where they went and talk about Star Road, which I think in first Paper Mario, you go to Star Road or something like that. Either go there or you, it gets mentioned or something. I'm trying to remember. I should play Paper Mario again, too. I haven't done that on the stream, you know, as a stream or a Let's Play either. It needs to happen. Paper Mario. You know, more Zeldas that I have already, you know, games I've already played a million times, but I just haven't played for you guys yet. I still, I, this year is going to have some of that. That's for damn sure. But anyways, that is all the stars. Star Road is re, uh, put, uh, it's reassembled. That's the word. We're going to get a little bit of a ending here for everything. Malo goes back home. GG. The only Geno reference you found in any Mario RPG after this one is in Mario Luigi Superstar Saga. Okay. Another set of games I'd, I need to play. At least those ones I haven't played, though, so we'd be able to have some blind playthroughs with those. Too many fucking games to play, y'all. Too many. I wonder what kind of challenge runs you can do with Paper Mario. I can't even think of one off the top of my head. Because I don't even like buying stuff in Paper Mario that much anyways. So I feel like a scavenger in a Paper Mario wouldn't even be that bad. I'd have to look into it. But anyway. There was Johnny up on his cliff. We got the Yoshis over here racing the fucking Crocomire or whatever. Crocodoo. Croc. The Mario and Luigi games are good. I've heard good things, and I have... I will say I have played Superstar Saga. I just never finished it. I thought Superstar Saga was really good. I just never finished it. I didn't even deal with this this shit. Like this, That's the bitch that does the jumping minigame at the Frog Fuchsia's Pond, but I didn't even deal with that shit. No point in this playthrough. Why would you marry that big booby bitch, Booster? Why would you even? I mean, I get that the Tiggos are nice, but Jesus, man. That lady is a con artist through and through, man. And of course, thank you for playing my game. A piece out, uh. Yoshi, you didn't do shit. Get out of that screen. All right, and I guess we get the parade at the end. That's usually how they do this, right? Hell yeah. Luigi re leading the parade. That's who also isn't in this game. They don't have Luigi in the game, which is kind of weird. Like, just even, like, to visit, to hear about. I think they mentioned him somewhere, his name. But he's not even, like, chilling at home like he is in Paper Mario. Because at least in Paper Mario, he's in the game. You don't use him, but he's there. But anyways, guys, that's Super Paper Mario. Or Super Paper Super Mario RPG. We gotta talk about Paper Mario too much. That's Super Mario RPG. Scavenger Run, the 10 year revisiting. It's been so long, it's been a good time. I mean, I still can't believe I've been doing this for 10 years. And, you know? The closer we got to 10 years, the more I felt I felt like we're gonna have to do some revisiting of stuff just for the the anniversary, for the, you know, for the for the nostalgia. For the lols. And Mario RPG was my first ever blind Let's Play, so it felt like it needed to happen. Plus, the quality is garbage. This is definitely one of the ones that needed a replay and a, and a better quality playthrough from me, for, from a video standpoint, from a sound standpoint, just everything about the original one. The only thing good about it is that it's blind and my reactions to things, but otherwise, I wouldn't go watch that again myself. It's very bad. Um, 
But yeah, hope you enjoyed. Hope that was fun. It definitely added a new challenge too, so that was fun. Still rocked through the game pretty fast, um, which is nice because when I, you know, when I take on a challenge run, I always worry it's going to add on extra hours that would just be ridiculous. But for this one, it wasn't too bad. Like I said, I only really got cock blocked a little bit at the sea area, but that was just because the groups of enemies there were pretty rough. And I, and I didn't save it a couple times. That kind of screwed me over. But it worked out in the end. We, we made it happen. And like everybody keeps saying, as soon as I got the lazy shell, this game was over. Peach became unstoppable. Unbeatable. Indubitable. But yeah, that was fun. So I, I'm sure some of you guys might be wondering... It's the 10 year anniversary. Is this all you have in store for the 10 year anniversary? Just replaying this game and we're, that's it? No, no, no. Uh, uh, uh. I actually have at least one other playthrough I intend to do this year. Obviously, it won't be right after this one. I'm going to give it a little bit of a breather before we touch it, but I definitely have one big playthrough that I need to replay. That I just It just needs to happen. And I have very good incentives to do it, not just because it's been 10 years. I've been wanting to do it anyway, so it's going to work out nicely with the 10-year anniversary being this year. Um, so I have one for sure that I want to do. And then I got a lot of other stuff I could do, I guess, to revisit. Like, I've thought about trying to revisit some Final Fantasies, but I'm like, I don't really want to replay a lot of them. I like them a lot, but I was very thorough with almost every single playthrough. So it's like, unless I'm just jonesing to play one for a day or something, I don't really feel like replaying any of them as a Let's Play or stream, you know? So I don't know. Unless somebody wanted me to do a challenge run, then someone can redeem it, but I'm not going to probably bring back any of the, the main Final Fantasy games unless there's some other thing I want to do with them. Like I said, a challenge run or something. TMNT 3 is not one I need to bring back, Luminous. And the only reason I don't need to bring that one back is because I did a one-off Wednesday where I replayed that game in its full entirety. So if you want to watch me replay some of those early Let's Plays, Mega Man 2, TMNT 3, um, technically Turtles in Time, TMNT 4, I didn't redo that game, but I did play like the reshelled version as a one-off Wednesday. I guess I could revisit Turtles in Time at some point. I didn't even think about that. But it would be nice to visit some turtles in general. We maybe we'll get to some turtle games this year that I haven't played. That could be fun. Um, another one that I think that I did in the first year was Sonic the Hedgehog. I'd love to get back to some more Sonic games this year as well. So that'd be cool. I'm still missing 13, 2, and 3. Oh, Lord. Don't even remind me, Magnadan. Again, anything I haven't done on the channel is still open to be possible, like 13, 2, and 3, and 10, 2. 10-2 is actually more likely to happen than the 13 ones, though. I, I hate 13-3. Or 13-2, rather. 13-3, I think, is okay. But 13-2 is fucking garbage. Turtles in Time was great. I love that game. I might I might revisit that this year. I could do that. We could do that in one sitting, like, quick thing. Um, maybe, maybe we'll hit it on a Super Nintendo fortune cookie or something. I don't know. We'll see. But definitely... I have at least one long playthrough I want to revisit, and then I might revisit some other stuff, um, or at least continue some series that I haven't been, I've been neglecting, like Turtles and Sonic, which I just mentioned, which are ideas in my head. So yeah, this is why one shouldn't eat mushrooms. Those toads were so high on drugs, their heads were lighting up in the night. I know, right? Crazy. Anyway, guys, we get our Mario fireworks at the end, and that is all, folks. I guess. We're going to get a fin screen. We're going to get a hundo drop is what we're going to get. How about a remake of that 2012 playthrough? You know, that one, Kappa. Kappa, indeed. What's up, Rio? Thank you for the hundo bitty drop. And I may have been alluding to exactly that. So don't you worry about it, sir. Welcome in, sir. Welcome in. Welcome into the credits here. I'm just finished up the game. This playthrough is done, matic And we can now move on to something new. Awesome. The Endo. And that's all, folks. Hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching Super Mario RPG Scavenger Run. I will see you guys on something new real soon. Probably not going to jump into anniversary stuff quite yet, but we got more lined up trust on that. See you guys then. Peace out.